Imagine a universe where vehicles are propelled by water, not only producing zero emissions, but also creating only a cloud of vapor. It's quite unlikely, isn't it? Actually, the Prius developing car maker that changed the automotive world, Toyota, has unveiled a game changer. Their next innovative spot won't be electric, but hydrogen powered. In this video, we are putting an emphasis on Toyota's courageous vision, an engine that operates through hydrogen. Definitely, you're right, hydrogen, the most common element in the universe. Nevertheless, we should not hesitate to get technical, so let us act. The hydrogen-powered engine? Toyota's engineers have made a fresh codification of an internal combustion engine in the next generation one. Unlike the oil-hungry or electric battery-dependent engines, hydrogen is instead the power source for it. The fuel cell technology of the car uses hydrogen gas as a fuel and only only emits water as the product. Hydrogen is the lightest element, which, combined with oxygen, produces energy in the form of electricity. A high-pressure tank for storing hydrogen is added to the hydrogen and led into the engine bay, where it is combined with the air's oxygen. It is evident that the resultant product is simply pure water, as the exhaust no harmful emissions. Just as a common gasoline engine, a hydrogen engine starts by igniting a mixture of hydrogen and air. Pistons go up and down, crankshafts rotate, and the force is obtained. On the other hand, in the case of gasoline engines, the fuel is first turned into electric energy that stores black SE. Chlorine dioxide or nitrogen oxides in hydrogen fuel cars are known as vehicles with good mileage. Hydrogen cars can travel long distances in a short time, unlike electric vehicles that require quite frequent charging. A hydrogen car has the ability to do more than just run several hundred miles on a glass of water. Unfortunately, there is still a road trip without having to worry about the kilometers. Have you ever waited for the charging of your EV? Hydrogen refueling is a piece of cake. It takes minutes, not hours. Drive up to a hydrogen refueling station, fill your car up, and you're back on the road. EV batteries utilize special elements like lithium, cobalt, and nickel. These materials have environmental and ethical concerns, mining practices, child labor, etc. Hydrogen engines sidestep this issue because they do not need massive battery packs. Environmental benefits. When hydrogen is consumed with a hydrogen engine, the exhaust that is released is water vapor only. Yes, you are right. The engine of hydrogen fuel cells has zero tailpipe emissions. Reversely to the conventional internal combustion engines, ICEs, which discharge all kinds of toxic substances like nitrogen oxides and carbon dioxide, hydrogen engines leave as the only waste a transparent ophthalmologist water. It's akin to riding around with a skywater purifier. Carbon dioxide, nitrogen oxides, particulate matter, and volatile organic compounds are emitted by gasoline and diesel engines. These pollutants are the main causes of smog, respiratory diseases, and climate change. Unlike hydrogen engines that only emit water vapor, there are no greenhouse gases or smoke pollution problems. The machine starts from the beginning in a neat and clean manner. EV are better for the environment than internal combustion engines because they do not burn fuel directly. Nevertheless, their environmental impacts rely on the electricity source. If an electric car is charged from a coal-fired power plant, it indirectly helps to release CO2. But in the case of the charging from wind and hydroelectric sources, it is a game for the environment environment. Play hydrogen engines are the most reliable among them. They have a collection and fueling facility, like ICE, but only release water vapor, no matter the source of the energy. Toyota is an idealistic planet where hydrogen is not only the fuel for the car. At the same time, it is for houses. The sun-sourced catalysis of hydrogen power that warms and provides electricity to houses, buses, trains, and even ships. The whole method of hydrogen production was fully established. Challenges and disruptions. There are already now EV charging stations, which have become increasingly commonplace, while those hydrogen refueling stations are still very few. Widespread use of gases at the global level can be made by their infrastructure expansion. Toyota is working on a hydrogen station network with the cooperation of other manufacturers. Storage and transmission of hydrogen safely is a problem. High pressure tanks are what we have been using. However, we are in need of material and safety protocol innovations, aiming to address these issues. Toyota has made substantial investment through research and development. Hydrogen technology is perfect for long journeys and doesn't rely heavily on batteries to perform. Picture taking a road trip without the hassle of driving around town and trying to find your lost electrics. What really helps this green transportation
the most is that the company's fuel cells are on more than a niche scale. Hydrogen fuel gets refilled in a matter of minutes compared to the charging of an EV, which can be a very time-consuming task. Regardless of sustainability, this means that quick refueling is a game-changer. Hydrogen might also be used in public transport like buses, trains, and even large ships. For instance, the Toyota automaker foresees the usage of hydrogen in almost all passenger cars, as well as buses, trains, and ships too. When this dream comes to life, in fact, a lot more different areas take a big leap from regular in their development areas, accepting personal transportation. Toyota is aspiring to achieve sustainable solutions for the environment. They are not planning to do everything with just one technology, EV or hydrogen. Rather, they will make a variety of them to cater to different needs and environmental concerns. Toyota's plans go farther, providing options to buyers other than electric cars. They are developing fuel cell stacks for homes, considering hydrogen-based generators for green fuel and partnering up with different companies for the joint development of a hydrogen ecosystem. Now, here's the million-dollar question. Is this the future of transportation? Will hydrogen engines disrupt the EV market, or will electrons continue to rule the roads? Let's end this video with that. Thanks for watching, and don't forget to like, comment, and subscribe to the channel. Also, hit the bell icon to get notified of the latest video. We will see you in the next video.